hello everyone once again welcome to talented developer in this video we are going to see like what kind of exception we will get during creating of connection so first of all I'm just going to use the wrong password and I'm going to enter and I'm going to run once so once you will run you will see here directly it's mentioned like okay it is invalid credential it's saying like bind is failed so this whole process like it is called a binding so now what I will do I will just go and I will create one more catch here I am going to catch the error of authentication so here you can see authentication exception so I am just going to name as a ex then here what we will do ex dot get masses so we'll see error so same things again I'm going to run this one so once you will run you can see here right we catch this exception here directly it's showing invalid credential so whenever you are getting error like invalid credential that means like your password is wrong okay now what I will do here here I'm going to give wrong OU okay now just once again run so once you will run you can see here again it's referring invalid credential bind fail so cannot find a partition right cannot find a pretty partition here so in previously error what we have done see cannot authenticate so if you're getting error like cannot authenticate that means like password is wrong and if suppose if a password is correct but I'm giving the wrong address so what will happen here here you can see cannot find a partition for so this kind of things please see now next thing what I will do I'm just going to give the port number is different okay now run you can see here port is out of range right this is called illegal argument exception if you need to handle you can again come and create here you can see naming communication exception right so this kind of exception, exception you can also handle so whenever you are getting like port out of range that means like definitely you have entered wrong port now I'm going to give the port correct but localhost is different so now again run here you can see localhost right root exception that means like if you're getting root exception that means you have given your localhost is wrong is unable to find that connection see here directly communication exception so this kind of exception will always go communication exception now what uh, will happen I'm going to give the wrong here so suppose if you are typing and on that time you have done something wrong like in the place of com you have given com1 so what will happen just run so once you are running you can see here it's saying class not found exception so if you are getting class not found exception that means like you have given wrong and if you see here cannot instantiate the class of a lack context factory that here root exception is there so if you scroll here you can directly see they are clearly mentioned here what we have done wrong so that means you can correct it so these are the probability exception you will get during creating of new connection so I hope you like that video please subscribe our channel for the latest update in next video we are going to see how to retrieve our user so in last video we have added some user so in next video we are going to retrieve all this user so please stay in touch thank you guys